Good afternoon, Big 12 fans, and welcome to the Big 12 First Pitch pregame show brought to you by Tire Pros. Game two just about set to get underway here between TCU and Texas, so let's take a look at how these two teams got here. Second home run hit by the Horn Frogs today, and Luke and Baker turns on the very next pitch, and he drives it off the top of the scoreboard. And this is crushed. Deep right field by Scout. Hassel back to the track, and it's gone. This one is touched, deep to left, and this one is gone. No, that, that cleared everything. It's not just gone, it's like gone, gone. So Bissonnette remains at second base, and a fly ball to left to Tyler Rand, that takes care of it as Arrington flies out, and this ball game is over on the run rule. Driven, deep right center field. Hassel and Sluter on the move, neither one will come close. Jones is gonna score. Boswell is in to score. Cody Clemens with an RBI triple and Texas pouring it on. Coming off one of the most dramatic victories we've seen so far at this year's championship, Texas will look to carry the momentum that they gained from Friday night into today. For more on UT, we send it down to Big 12 correspondent Annabelle Stefan. Thanks, Mitch. Well, after yesterday's win versus Oklahoma State, head coach Augie Garrido was all smiles about this Texas Longhorns team, and he was really impressed with the way his group has continued to battle against adversity here in the Big 12 Baseball Championship. He did bring up the luck factor and said that it has been on the Longhorn side for the past couple of games. You have to know that TCU got yesterday to rest and get off their feet, so Texas is obviously a little bit more tired and that might show out there today, but junior Tress Barrera said that this team right now, every single person really has that hunger in their eyes. They really want to fight, and they know what they have to do. Augie said every new game is like opening day, so we'll see what the Longhorns are able to do out there versus the Horn Frogs. Headed into today's game, TCU has outscored their opponents 25-10 to 10 at this year's championship. As their offense looks to continue its momentum against UT today, we head down to Christine Williamson with more on the Horn Frogs. Thanks, Mitch. Really just three things for this team going into this matchup. Number one, they're coming off of a day of rest. I saw Luke and Baker in the hotel yesterday. He said they were going to go watch a movie, so really they just got off their feet, kind of took a relaxation day and got away from baseball, which I think is really important going up against this Texas team that had a really long game yesterday. Number two, speaking of Luke and Baker, he has been a hot hitting freshman for this team all week. Number three, head coach Schlossenagel said that the game begins and ends with pitching. So really just seeing what they're able to do on the mound against this Texas team who's been hitting pretty well also. All right, Mitch, back to you. As first pitch nears, here's a look at your Tire Pros projected starters. TCU will send Jared Janzak to the hill as the right-hander has a 6-3 record on the season with a 2.28 ERA in 55 and a third innings pitched. Texas looks to Connor Mayes as a sophomore has a 3.83 ERA in 54 complete innings pitched. TCU, Texas on a gorgeous Saturday afternoon is right around the corner. For the Big 12 Digital Network, I'm Mitch Gerber.